Paw Patrol Mommy here today to do a Target baby box unboxing and to do a mini Target haul with all of you. So I went to Target about two weeks ago and then just didn't record a video so I thought I would combine the uh, baby box with the mini Target haul that I do have. Now I've had this box probably for, I don't know, about two months and it got put inside a bag and then the bag got put away and the box went missing and so I found it. And I actually cannot even remember what is in the Target baby box now. Um, I knew when I ordered it. And I think, I cannot remember if this box was $5 or $10. So it's like a subscription box that you get from Target, but it's not a repeating one. Um, let's go ahead and undo it. So the bag, the box is a little bit smushed just because it was in storage or inside a bag. So it looks like on top you have... Um, it comes with a $10 coupon off of $50 or more in the baby department. So that's a nice thing. That right there pays for your box if this is a $10 box. That is really nice. Okay, so this is what the box looks like. Don't take anything out of here. Let's see if I can get this set up. Okay, so right here we have triple medicated paste. All right, so we'll try that out. My girls don't get diaper rash, but uh, we can always, well, there is a Mistella Hydra Baby. Let's see here. A Cetaphil Baby Wash and Shampoo. We like the Cetaphil brand, so that's good. Dove Baby Tip to Toe Wash. You know what? Um, I'm going to check the ingredients in this, but this one might be good to keep in our bag for after we go to my sister's or whatever, and we go swimming or we go to the beach so I can shower the babies at her house. And then an Honest Company Hand Sanitizer. This is awesome because you guys know I love my Honest Company Hand Sanitizers. And it looks like an Avent 0-6 to six Months. Binky, this will probably be going into a um, giveaway um, for my next giveaway that I do on my channel. This is like dish soap. Yep. Oh, laundry detergent. Oh, that's really cool. So method extra four times concentrated laundry soap. And let's see, is this good for HE? So I'm not sure if that one's good for HE or not. So we'll have to look. And oh, look, free and clear wipes. I'm very excited about this because I love wipes. And I actually have never tried the seventh generation wipe so this is a really good box you guys again i can't remember if this box was five dollars or ten dollars but even if it was ten dollars it comes with that ten dollar coupon so this is really it's really a good little box i think that the only thing that the only things that i probably won't use just depending on what the ingredients are is the dove wash but i might use that this uh triple paste just because we don't really get diaper rash and we're not really in diapers and the um zero to six month binky but other than that, you know, I'm pretty impressed, you guys. So that's it for the Target box. So let's go ahead and move the stuff out of the way, and then we'll go ahead and do our mini haul. I'm going to go ahead and move on to the stuff that we got um, that is not in the baby box. And this we opened, you guys, just because my two-year-old was so excited about this. This was on their clearance end cap, and you can't see it, but this is the Crayola whiteboard set. So this is normally $9.99. We got it 50% off. It comes with four little dry erase markers. We just opened this the other night because she was so excited. But the one thing I really like, you guys, is it comes with these dry erase sheets. So it comes with some plain white ones, and then it comes with ones that are, are printed as well. I mean, I like the plain white ones so the girls can do, like, free drawing. Um, but for five bucks, to get the container, to get the markers, to get the laminate sheets, I just... I thought this was a good deal. So again, this is made by Crayola, and normally it's $9.99, so they may have it on the clearance at your Target as well, if you're looking for something like that. And along those lines, so if you guys have been watching my Target videos, you know I bought a lot of back-to-school kind of whiteboard books and that kind of thing, especially for my three-year-old to start doing some work, but was having the hardest time finding washable dry erase markers that were non-toxic. The hardest time, and finally found some at Target. So we did pick those up. And then again, along those lines, I don't know if you guys have seen these, but they're the paint brushes that you just squeeze the bottom and the paint comes out of. And then when the paint runs out of these, you can use these, you can fill them with water. My mom had the genius idea um, to put water in them when they're empty, and then you can use them with regular watercolor palettes. So we have those plain, just like 99 cent watercolor palettes. You fill these with water and then they, they don't have to be dipping with like a cup or a bowl of water. So that works really good as well. And then we got another one of these pens from the dollar spot. So I found a Shopkins pen a few weeks ago that had these multiple, you know, colors in it. And it didn't have a stamper. I really wish that the ones now didn't have stampers because I'm not loving this. This will not have to be for the three-year-old. I don't trust the two-year-old at all to have this one. But I only have one and they fight over who gets to play with it all the time. So I went on the hunt looking for just a regular one. But they all have a stamper top. 
I only found these cute little magnetic bookmarks. I thought this would be good for my planner. Oh, you guys, and these are really cool. So my girls love to find things. So these are find it fast cards. And I thought this would be good for colors, for shapes, for all kinds of things. So I'm just, I'm super excited to do these. These are going to be a great thing for when we're out and about and the girls are bored. And I don't know if you guys, any of you just watched my Target, my Halloween haul. But um, one of the things that we got were a bunch of little Halloween erasers. And one of the things that would be good is for the girls to put as they find things, like find someone who has, you know, a headband on. They can put a marker on it. So, anyways, I thought that would be a really good thing. And then my husband loves Batman. And uh, about, a, I don't know, a week and a half ago, we were at Target and both babies got a Batman lanyard. And my husband's like, where's mine? So we went and got him one. And then just kind of add to our school section and the house. These were on um, the dollar section. And again, in my other video, if you just watched the Halloween haul, our Target was having a clearance, 70% off. So we got these for 70% off. So it's a calendar and a magnetic chore chart. So I've been meaning to get a chore chart. chart. And this one, you can either use the pre-printed or you can write in your own, which I like. And then we got, um, I have a lot of silverware for the babies, I have a lot of plastic silverware, but what I liked about these is that they have a metal, they have metal teeth and a metal spoon por portion, but on the back side, I don't know if you guys can see this here, it has like a little lip right here so that if the kids put it down on like the table or somewhere, the actual portion that they put in their mouth that they eat on doesn't sit, it doesn't hit the, the actual table, the grimy part. Um, not that, you know, tables are grimy, but you really don't want them putting their stuff down and then putting it back in their mouth. So, I like that. Oh, and we found this on clearance, you guys. So, this is a little, I say little, it's actually huge. It's a sand roller, so it makes shapes in the sand when you go. And we go to places that have a lot of sand a lot. So, that was a lot of fun. And then the only food item that we bought is, I don't know if you guys have tried this one. So, we're big tea drinkers and... Um, we don't normally buy this kind of tea, but this flavor everyone in my family likes. It's the peppermint. It's got a really kind of smooth peppermint flavor. It tastes good hot or iced, and both the babies like this as well. So we picked that up. And the last things that I have are some clothing items. So I have uh, two dollar spot socks for the babies. So they have unicorns on them. The girls love unicorns. So a smaller pair for the baby and a bigger pair for the three-year-old. And then we got some clearance clothes. So a lot of them are matching. So we got two of the little dresses, the Cat and Jack. So I have two of these, these are the same. One's a 3T and one's a 4T. And then for the baby, a little pink shirt, with some tights. And then we also got her this little plant shirt, which is really cute. I feel like the girls are just growing out of their clothes as fast as I can buy them, they're outgrowing them. We got this little shirt. So this one's a 3T. I try to usually buy her like a 4T in the Cat and Jack stuff just because for some reason I feel like it runs smaller. Um, and they only have these leggings in 2T, so this is going to be like an exact fit for her now, but I usually buy her 3T leggings. And then for the 3 year old, I got her matching pink and matching leggings so they can match. And then they had these really cute orange sparkly leggings on sale as well. My girls love to be in leggings. They love to be comfortable. And the very last thing that I got you guys that I'm super duper excited about is this sign. And so this is just kind of one of those happy birthday signs really quick to fill out. You can use the, the chalk pens on them. And I'll insert at the end. My mom, for everybody's birthday, she makes big signs on. We have a big easel chalkboard. So she likes to decorate that for everybody for their birthdays and everybody signs them. And I'll ins insert some pictures at the end of what our, our big easel chalkboards look like. But I thought this would be fun just to have the kids hold when their birthdays come. They can hold it and we can take a picture with them holding it because obviously they can't hold the easel. They can just stand by it. But again, I'll put a I'll put insert some pictures at the end so you can see what the big easel looks like. But I was super excited about this one and this one was three dollars. I can't remember if this one was part of the 70% off clearance or not. But that's it for my Target baby box unboxing and mini haul. That's it for me, everybody. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you haven't already, I'd love it if you hit that subscribe button. Go ahead and give me a big thumbs up if you like what I'm doing. I'll talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.